Yo, what's up everybody? External here. Welcome back to Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze. Today we're doing World 3. And the question of the day, once again, I'm getting it out the way nice and early. Also, I really like this cutscene. That was really cool. Is... What's a Donkey Kong game that you want to play that you haven't yet? I want to play Donkey Kong Jungle Beat. I just haven't had the chance to yet. I need the... What's it called? Bongos. The Donkey Kong Bongo controller for the GameCube to play it. I know there's a Wii version where you don't. But everything's more expensive on the Wii. So far, this level's cool. I am playing it the wrong way, though. You're supposed to grab onto the ceiling. But I did it wrong. Oh, that was a secret. I just thought I did it wrong. Oh. I just had to roll through. Oh. Now what? What? Oh, there were vines there. I forgot how to grab onto vines. Got it. Is there a Kong letter here? That's how long this level is that the... I am dead. Oh, and we're destroying that. I took damage the second that I... I see what to do here. I'm gonna try to go for this Kong letter. As we're already on a good streak. Oh, this is sick. This is actually, like, sick. And we got every Kong letter. Can we get the heart? Ooh, that was so close. Oh, I forgot I can jump off that using Funky. Oh, I'm dead. Like, I think I'm actually like... Nope. This is a trippy level. Or at least that section's very trippy. And then that's the barrel. Let's go. First level done. Quite a fun one, actually. A little... It was very trippy. Because all the... At the end with the platforms swinging like that. I'm waiting for the rocket barrel level because I'm pretty sure this world has one as I don't think world one or two had them both had minecart levels I do expect to see Rambi in this level I looked up if that was his name after recording the last episode and it is so I didn't sound like an idiot for once, which I'm glad about. What, do I go up this way? This level progression's weird. Let me get that coin. But other than Jungle Beat, 
I also do want to play Donkey Kong Country Returns, like the original one, not the 3DS remake. Can I get it? Let's go. Checkpoint. Let's roll through here. Bruh. I actually just started thinking about what my next playthrough is going to be, and I have some good ideas. I can't wait for you guys to see those. But first, we got to finish this game. So, like usual, I'm planning... Oh, no. Is that going to fall and chase us? Like some Indiana Jones movie with the giant boulder. Oh, I, it was so close to dying there. Oh, I could have gotten that. If I was a second earlier, I could have gotten that. That's level two. So far, this world's the most fun I've had playing this game. It's weird, I only remember worlds 1, 2, 3, 5, and 6. I don't remember world 4, so... Next episode's gonna be interesting. I'm actually filming this the morning that this goes out. Might have time to film another episode this morning. I'm off from work tomorrow, so I have all day tomorrow. Wait, is this like the other games where you have to roll through the... Oh, wait, Ramby's here. I was going to say, do I have to roll through the tornadoes? Or does Ramby just give us tornado immunity? Oh, you have to jump through the tornadoes. Okay, got it. What the hell? Oh, no. Thank you for saving us. Lightning strikes and tornadoes. Run. And flaming birds and spiky birds. What is going on? I have no clue. Ooh, almost just fell. Oh, wait. I can get back on. Oh no. I remember this. I remember this being annoying. Yeah, now if I get pushed back, I die. And this is the same thing, but with lightning strikes and falling platforms. They like to make this as extreme as possible. Into the dust storm. This is actually a really cool level. I almost died at that jump. Now I'm doing this without Rambi, which I don't know if that's the way to go or not. I probably need Rambi. That's a flying... Not a bull. What's the name of the animal? Ox, I think it's called. I feel like this is the end. There's going to be one more lightning strike, though, just to scare the complete and utter crap out of me. Let's go. We got a one-up. And that level's... That level was awesome. That was actually a really cool level. The level design for Donkey Kong games is so cool because it's so different from Mario. We just unlocked the... The shop and... A fire level. Scorching Torch. Let's see how this one is. 
Because I actually do not remember this level. I remember it existing. Oh, water balloons. The whole gimmick's gonna be water balloons. How many times will I actually use them? That I don't even know myself. As I like to just speed run through levels, I tend to not go for the gimmicks like that. Unless they're completely necessary to continue, like here. Whoa, the floor just really started to heat up there. I'm hoping for a checkpoint soon. As I'm on 1 HP. Bruh. Oh, I had a checkpoint. When did I get this? I don't even remember getting that. Thank you. And then the floor ignites after a while. My parkour skills are decent, so I'm not too worried. This is the first level where I won't be going for every Kong letter because the level's on fire. I say that and then I die getting a Kong letter. I know how to get it now. Let's try that again. But I've been just... I have saw something on YouTube recently that I just thought was so bizarre and actually like funny at the same time. I thought I was dead there. That whole AI sponge series. I have a couple friends who watch it and even have a fish named after them. But I'm like, it's so bizarre. It's such a weird thing. Oh, another checkpoint that I don't remember getting. I should just quit this game. <laughs> but AI sponge is such a weird thing to me. I just cheesed this level completely. Or at least that part of the level. You can tell we're almost at the end because we just got the last Kong letter. Throw a water balloon. What? I thought that was the floor. I'll see you guys when I get back to that part. Here we are again. I'm gonna go right after that. Okay, I see the trick. It's to jump right after a fireball. Here we go. We did it. That level. was actually a pain in my ass that's one of the harder levels we've played that's for sure these levels are dumbed down in difficulty thanks to funky kong it looks like this is going to be a longer world than i expected actually i was expecting it to be six levels it looks like it might be eight I wonder why this one's called Twilight Terror. What kind of terror are we gonna face? Just let me roll. There. I see nothing. Oh yeah, I see the terror. I see this level being terrible. The 
barrel doesn't even work. Do I have to mash? Oh, I have to mash A. What was that in the background? What is that? That's actually terrifying. Yeah, I remember that obstacle from when we played this level on stream. Checkpoints I don't think are common in rocket barrel levels, so I'm gonna have to survive this. There's gonna be a lot of editing for this level. You're gonna see a lot of edits for this level, is what I'm saying. As this level's probably gonna make me push back my stream, which starts in 35 minutes. I don't even remember what I'm playing today. Oh, I'm playing Pokemon. I'm doing Sword and Shield No Evolutions today. I'm excited for that. I was debating whether I do that stream or not, because I'm like, I like the idea. I wanna do it, but I'm not sure if you guys will. Oh, there's the secret exit. And there's a sushi factory. There's a checkpoint. That was a pretty obvious secret exit. I think we're almost at the end. If so, this is the easiest rocket barrel level in existence. Oh no. Why are they jumping? Stop jumping! Please tell me the rocket barrel breaks down and we're done with this level. Oh, that fish almost got us. Oh, now we have a dropper section. It's down here. I want to check what's down here. I'm good. That's a secret exit that I don't care about. There's a lot of secret exits in this level. There was like three of them. We got two Kong letters. Here we go. Cannon Canyon. 3-6. I just remembered, I think I remember who the boss is for this world. If that's the case, oh, this one's gonna be fun. And we're back to the simple Donkey Kong hijinks. Except now there's explosives. And we're breaking into some kind of fortress. Okay, that's pretty cool. The 3D vibe of this. Are we going to break through that canyon? Nope. We got the puzzle piece. They just tried to shoot at us, but we just broke down their wall and turned it to a bridge. There's a lot of explosives in this level. I think that's the whole theme. What? What was that? Do I have to, like, jump off the bird? Oh, never mind. You have to wait for them to align. That is way more stressful than it needs to be. I'm gonna wait for you to jump again so I can get that letter. Okay, that wall bounce is pretty cool. I like how this level's actually like different too. That's the last Kong letter. And I got it. That was a short and pretty different level. I actually liked the twist. 
And I think it's boss time. I think it's boss time. Yep, triple trouble. It is the boss I was expecting. I'm probably gonna film the next part tonight. Because I actually want to finish this Let's Play today. So tomorrow I can start recording the next one. Because I have a really cool idea for the next one. Why are they spin dashing? This isn't Sonic. Like, this seriously isn't Sonic the Hedgehog. I don't know why they're spin dashing. Oh, this is an easy one to deal damage doing. When they do this, you just go like that. I'm probably beating them wrong. Nope. I think they're up to the second phase. Yeah, you knocked out one of them, so now they're pissed off. Okay, and then I mess it up. That's a spiky one. I want to avoid that. Boom. I failed so many times on this boss fight on stream. I think I took well over two hours for it. But this was back in like October when I applied at GameStop actually. Yeah, this is the hard part for me. Is the... Okay. We got a heart. He's using the Shadow Clone Jutsu again from Naruto. Except this time they're throwing explosives and swinging around. Let's see. And we're back. This is the second attempt. I just decided to edit out most of this attempt as... It's already, it's stuff you've already seen. Hopefully we can beat the boss in only two tries. I would actually be like ecstatic if we could do that. That's one hit. I think each of these guys are three hits. You gotta be ready for this guy to go and attack. That's two hits. I think this should be the final hit. He's gonna use Shadow Clone Jutsu again. Oh, it's just the bomb attack again. Okay. And... Oh, we actually did it. 19 hits. The first boss fight where we actually scored points by hitting. 19. And that is World 3 Bright Savannah. Definitely an innovative world compared to the first two. I enjoyed this one a lot. 
I'm excited to see what world four is as I don't remember. Oh no, I remember this world now. This one was a pain. If you guys are ready to see me suffer, comment, like, subscribe, hit that bell so you know when we play Seabreeze Cove World 4. But thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace, everybody. Have a great day.